some small guests to present to you. Uganda was dubbed the Pearl of Africa by Winston Churchill when he last came to visit. And, and, and this is our brand. We would like to encourage you to come and visit. Uh, so we have um, an array of gifts here that perhaps you'll open at an appropriate time, but they all uh, encourage you to come and visit. Uh, we have coffee. We have some of the best coffee in the world. Uh, we have... We share with some of the countries, uh, the gorillas in the world are only found in Uganda. Uh, and this year is a symbol of those gorillas. Uh, so I'm sure when you look at it, um, it should remind you of where we come from. Um, and plus a very famous uh, t-shirt that I hope can fit you. So please accept this visit, Mr. Mayor, on behalf of myself and the team and our head of state. Put your hands for Ghana. Put your hands for Uganda. Put your hands for the gold winner, Tanzania. My name is David Moorcroft. I used to be an athlete many years ago. Same again, same event as the brilliant Chepta guy ran, but he runs a lot faster. But today is the welcoming ceremony into the village for Team Uganda and other nations. It's a little bit of dance, a little bit of music, a massively warm welcome from everybody involved in the games. And as you can see, a little bit of party time as well before the competition. Uh, you can see in the background, everyone is having fun. We're getting accustomed to Birmingham. Today we had our welcome ceremony. It's just a brief one by the mayor of uh, Birmingham and everything has been going on very well. Uh, we checked in last night and uh, the rooms are quite good. The village is quite good, the ambience is amazing. And we're just looking forward to the next couple of days and then our tournament days. We have to win at least two of our games in the group stages. It's something we can achieve and I think the boys are ready for it. And we're just ready to show the world that we are good and we have very good rugby in Uganda. Uh, we've had to get our teams who are staying at the different villages ferried in here because as you know, uh, the, the, the different uh, athletes and officials are staying at uh, several, uh, several centers. Uh, but it's usually um, a very short ceremony just to introduce you to the local mayor uh, and also part of acclimatization. Um, so it was an opportunity for us to just, first of all, share the space with Tanzania and Ghana, with whom uh, the ceremony uh, was held. Uh, so it was nice. Uh, and the, the, the mood in the team is one of excitement. People are looking forward to, be, to resuming their training now that uh, they're, they're going to, to, to sort of... Well, I'm happy to be here. Honestly, it's good to be back for the, my second Commonwealth Games. I'm going to swim 100 freestyle, 100 backstroke and 50 backstroke. I look forward um, to national records, personal bests, maybe having a uh, higher rank in Africa in the relay team, as well as my team doing, you know, very good. Yeah, looking forward to that. If it makes a means, that would be good. If we pass through hits, that would be uh, uh, First of all, I'm used of the weather and I've been training well. Uh, it is so, so, so important to, uh, to be here uh, in the early, uh, as early as I came. And uh, I'm very well and I'm, I'm okay, I'm not sick and I'm well prepared.